Hello crochet lovers and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet this beautiful pumpkin coaster. And it's pretty easy for uh, beginners also. You know it's Halloween time and I think it's good to do something with pumpkins and I also love pumpkins. And I'm going to use 3 millimeter crochet hook also I use as a coffee holder. Before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell button to open the notifications. Okay, let's start. Okay, first of all, we we start with orange yarn and make a magic circle, wrap around your finger like this and pull up a loop. Hold your circle with your fingers and chain 3. We are going to make 12 double crochets into the circle and I'll make the first one with chain 3. And go on, make 11 more double crochets into the circle. And close your circle, slip stitch into the third chain and I'm going to insert my hook into the top of the third chain and slip stitch. And we have a little circle now, chain 3. In this row we are going to make two double crochets into every double crochets. And we are going to have 24 double crochets when we finish this row, okay? We are just making a classic circle with double crochets, of course. This is our last double crochets and I'm going to count make slip stitch and join the circle and chain 3 again in this row we are going to make one double crochet and two double crochets I'm going to start with two double crochets and then one double crochet into the next space. When you have thirty six double crochets, you can make a slip stitch and join like me okay one more row chain three and in this row we are going to make and one double crochet then two double crochets into the same stitch one one two this is our this is our pattern in row 4 and when you finish this row you should have 48 stitches
I have two double crochets left and I'm going to slip stitch into the third chain and complete my little circle and I think it's enough for me but if you want you can make more rows but it's uh, enough for a glass make chain one and single crochet one two three four five and six and then chain two skip one stitch and make one double crochet into the next stitch chain two and skip one stitch and then make one double crochet chain two skip one stitch and make one double crochet into the next stitch chain two and one more time skip one and make two double crochet uh, one double crochet one two three four five six seven chain two and skip one stitch and make one double crochet when we have eight holes between the double crochets chain two and skip one stitch and make single crochet make single crochet six times and again chain two and skip one stitch make one double crochet we are going to make the same pattern again chain two and skip one stitch and make one double crochet into the next stitch you should repeat eight times when you have eight holes chain two and make single crochet and then we are going to make one more single crochet slip stitch into the first single crochet and that's all chain one and make single crochet into the every single crochet stitch When you finish the single crochets, make three double crochets into the first hole and one double crochet into the double crochet stitch. Make three double crochets into the space and make one more double crochet 
into the double crochet stitch and repeat the same pattern Make three double crochets into the last space when we get the single crochet stitches you should just make single crochet into the every single crochet stitches Okay, you should just repeat the same pattern here also because it's the opposite side. Three double crochets into the space and one double crochet in top of the double crochet stitches okay I'll just have two single crochet left and I'm going to complete single crochets one two and slip stitch into the first single crochet and our pumpkin is almost ready but this is the final row and I'm going to make single crochet into the every stitches all the way around make slip stitch into the first stitch and I'm going to uh, go on with uh, green yarn and we are going to make a leaf make a slip knot and chain 12 And we are going to make one single crochet into the very first stitch and then one more single crochet and make two half double crochets into the following stitches yarn over pull all three loops together and make one more half double crochet And then two double crochets into the following stitches, one double crochet into the each two stitches, and then yarn over twice and make treble crochet, pull through two, pull through two, and pull through two together. This is treble crochet in US terms. And make one more treble crochet, yarn over twice, 
and insert your hook into the following stitches and pull through two, pull through two, pull through two loops together. And we are going to make two, uh, two double crochets. and two half double crochets into the last stitch make make three um, single crochet and turn around the leaf then repeat the same pattern here also Make one half double crochet and two double crochets and two treble crochets. Yarn over twice and make treble crochet and make two double crochets again and make two half double crochets and one single crochet into the last stitch then slip stitch into the first chain and we have a little leaf for the pumpkin you don't have to make a leaf but i i really like this little leaf you can use everywhere also and chain one I'm going to join with my pumpkin and pull the orange loop and then you can cut the orange yarn and I'm going to make one single crochet into the very first stitch and then one single crochet into the following four stitches and one more one two three chain three and Make one double crochet into the following stitches. Chain three counts as double crochet, by the way. And you should have five double crochets at the end of this row. Okay. And then turn our work and make slip stitch into the every stitch four times five times sorry and then slip stitch into the double crochet and then chain 20 and make half double crochet into the very first stitch
and make three half double crochets into the every stitch This is my last one and you can cut the yarn. I don't know the name of the curly leaf, but I'm sure it has a name. <laughs> Two pumpkin coasters for the for the Halloween. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Please subscribe to my channel and and see you next week. Happy Halloween!